hello students hope all of you are well and in good health today also we are doing from ct and uh, the topic is from algebra itself its uh, exponents and its operation let's watch it so the topic here is exponents and order of operations let us start the first question see here we have to use the board mass that is you have to first of all solve whatever there is inside the braces so here it is 7 square means 49 minus 9 this divided by 8 and outside bracket is 2 it means 49 minus 9 is 40 divided by 8 and then multiplying by 2 so this is basically 40 divided by 8 is 5 and then times 2 it means this is equal to 10 so the answer is 10 question number 2 again we will first of all solve whatever there is inside the bracket so it is 20 minus 2 to the power 4 is 16 and 16 minus 7 or 4 times 8 then 16 minus 7 is 9 so i will simply write 20 minus 9 by 4 times 8 then when we multiply we just cancel this out we get 19 minus 3 and 20 minus 18 9 to the 18 so it is 19 minus 3 times 2 this is 3 times 2 because this gives you 2 it gives you 6 and 19 minus 6 is 13 so the answer for this second question is 13 next now here what we do we need to use the board mass or pem das pem das pem das says that parenthesis exponents multiplication division addition subtraction so first of all we multiply so it will be 72 divided by 9 times 2 gives you 18 all over 6 so 72 divided by 18 is 4 and 4 divided by 6 is 2 over 3 so the answer is 2 over 3 question number 4 5 cube first of all solve the exponents so it is 125 Minus one by two times of twelve plus twelve divided by three gives you four, and then this is one twenty-five minus half of sixteen, and then this gives you eight. One twenty-five minus eight gives you one one seven, which is the answer. Going to question number five, what is the value of two c whole square over a square? That is four c square. Or a square minus 10 times of b plus c b plus a over c. Okay, now plug in the values. Uh, first of all, c square is 25, and 25 times 4 is 100. Divided by a square, that is 4. <coughs> sorry, 10 times of b plus c b plus sorry b plus a. These two gives you 1, and divided by 5 because c is 5. So this gives you twenty-five minus two. So the answer should be twenty-three. Next, what is the value of this expression at x equal to four, y equals to minus one, z equals to nine minus three? So it is nine minus two x, that is eight, divided by z, that is minus three, minus one. So minus times minus one will be plus one, whole cube. So that will be nine minus eight divided by. This will be minus two cube. Minus two cube will be minus eight. So when I divide first of all, I get eight minus eight divided by minus eight, which is plus one. Nine plus one gives you ten. Going to question number seven, what's the value of seven divided by q square? So first of all, seven divided by q q square is one over four times two, and then all over two p. Two p means it is eight. Then multiplying by minus p, that is minus four. Plus six q that is six times one by two that is three and minus two or minus q minus q is minus one by two. So if I observe carefully, this is basically seven divided. First of all, we divide. It means we have to just uh, multiply it by four. So that is seven times four. First of all, we have to uh, multiply. So this is seven divided by. One by two, or eight, and times this will be minus four, minus four, minus three, 
minus 4 uh, plus 3 that is minus 1 so one will be minus 3 divided by minus 1 by 2 so this gives you 7 into 2 that is 14 14 by 8 times 3 times 2 is 6 so this gives you 2 4 star 2 3 star 2 2 star 2 7 star it gives you 21 over 2 or it is 10.5 hope you have understood this one let us go to the last question last question says what is the value of c minus 2a plus b so here c is 5 by 2 minus twice of a that is minus 1 by 2 plus b that is 3 over 2 then c minus a that is 5 by 2 minus of minus 1 by 2 so plus 1 by 2 whole square so in denominator we have 6 over 2 that is 3 square right and numerator we have 5 over 2 minus 1 by 2 times of 1 minus 2 times of 1 by 2 plus 3 by 2 that is 2 by 2 that is 1 so it gives you 5 by 2 minus 2 over 9 so it gives you 1 by 2 over 9 so the final answer will be 1 over 18 so the answer for this is 1 over 18 so this is all about your exponents and order of expressions see you in next video bye thank you so much for watching this video do like it share it and subscribe it